Welcome to Talk at the Urinal. I'm John Gonzalez. Me, Blatz. Uh, we have a brand new format for you. It's pretty dope. Talk at the Urinal 10. It's called the Talk at the Urinal 10. Tattoo 10. Tattoo 10. It's 10 questions, 10 answers, 10 topics. 10 Gronk spikes. <laughs> 10 chimichangas. <laughs> chimichangas, bro. Dude, I haven't seen you in a while. You look good, dude. New dude, new shirt. This guy's lo- I'm loving it. I got That's all I got, bro. Right go. You look good, bro. Is this facial hair? Yeah, dude. I'm trying to I like, like that. I'm trying to I like that. Like, 10 t I'm trying to go James Harden on you. I'm trying to go 10 t Ooh, 10 t 10 topics. Talk to you and all. Starts right now. Is it, I mean, is it Jim Rose Sabres, Peyton Manning, or is it Pats versus Giants? Can you, can you please explain the news playing this weekend? I honestly don't have a straight answer for that. Um, it's no secret that the Colts... And uh, start the timer. <laughs> there we, we go. Start the timer, dude. It's no secret that the Colts and and, and Peyton Manning are going to be separating sometime yeah. soon. They're going to make it a big deal. The funny thing is, it's Peyton Manning. The house that he built. The house that he built. <laughs> he has to fa- he has to see his brother. Not yeah. Try brother. to get his second ring versus his biggest rival, basically. The guy who's been compared to the last ten years, right? Right. Okay, so yeah. every any story in football right now that's not. The Super Bowl is the Colts and Jim Mercer yeah, and Ben Manning. Listen, yeah. So, like, do they not like each other? What's happening? Blah, blah, blah. And then, but two days two days from now, there's going to be a huge game. Pass for his journey. Right, and you can barely, it's not that you can't tell, but. No, no of course. There's a little bit of lot made about. I never had it. We never had it like this. It's usually always focused you know on the Super Bowl. You know who would be a good uh, person to ask this question? Who? Andrew Luck. Oh, yeah. I was wondering. I know. We haven't heard. <laughs> Number one pick. <laughs> exactly. They, they claim to be <laughs> like. Oh, maybe Robert Griffin. Oh, yeah, maybe just okay. to start another story. Oh, Come my on. gosh. No, uh, definitely not. Oh, definitely not. time's up. Definitely Next not. question. Number two. If Tom Brady wins his fourth ring, is he the greatest QB of all time? John, give me your take on that. Uh, obviously, he's competing with who? Joe Montana. Joe Montana. It, it, it's so close, okay. Eric. Uh, Joe Montana went 4-0. and Right now, Brady could oh, go 4-1. and Four and never game. lost? Never lost a game. Yeah, I know. <sighs> and he was blowing out teams. I mean, Tom Brady's only been winning it by three, and arguably Joe Montana played better defense. Back then, it was was it more of a defensive league? Absolutely. What and is it now? It's completely offensive. Especially, especially this well, game. let's not give it. Let's still no. give these guys time. If you're getting the numbers, Tom Brady has, you know, he's only, what, 600 yards away from passing. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he's, he has more touchdowns. Yeah, yeah. It's tough. Is there an argument? I think it's in the moment. Like, the guys back then watching Montana would say Montana, but we're in the moment right now watching Brady. We'll say Brady. Don't, don't you think that's how it is? Kind of Absolutely, works? yeah. If Tom Brady wins his fourth ring, is there a legitimate argument? Yes, definitely. Absolutely. I agree. Definitely. definitely. Joe Montana, watch your back. <laughs> watch your back. Next question. <laughs> Number three. If Eli wins, he'll have two rings. One more than his brother. I, I gotta ask it. Will Eli Manning be considered better than Peyton Manning? Go. Talent wise, no way. No. But what is it? Doesn't matter how you perform in regular season or playoffs. Playoffs. In any league, this that's dude, we judge this dude time. Peyton Manning is average in playoffs. Right. This dude Eli Manning wins. He has more. What he has like what? How many road wins now? Wait, I think most of all time. Or well, close to all it. his wins are on the road. Yeah. And making just huge plays. Right. Already has a Super Bowl ring. Yeah. He wins if he beats Brady again, who we who we just consider the, the best QB ever. He would have beat Brady twice, something Peyton Manning couldn't do. Now let's argue. Let's argue. Peyton Manning it's it's to me it's he like could easily have the most celebrated career, yep. but he'll never be better than Peyton Manning. Peyton be Manning Peyton. the Giants would take Peyton Manning today. They would. They would. And Peyton Manning look when he doesn't play. The right. team wins. But, one game. to Eli's credit, he plays in the NFC East, one of the toughest divisions year in and year out, and Peyton Manning plays in what division? The AFC South? Terrible, bro. Texans have sucked every single yeah, year until now. Exactly. The Titans are never, I mean, so, barely. So, what's our answer? No. Talent wise, no. No. Is he, is he, is he real? Is he clutch? clutch? Is, he, is he clutch? Yeah, yeah most four quarter touchdowns yeah, in the yeah. season ever. So, so we'll still take Peyton, but Eli's coming. Yeah, question number. Question number four. Gronk. 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 <laughs> Love that guy. 
Oh my goodness. I didn't know who he was last year. Was no one did. <laughs> no, me Will Rob Gronkowski's ankle affect the outcome of the game? Go. It will definitely affect the outcome of the game. But I think he's going to play. Yeah. And definitely if he plays, it's going to affect the outcome of the game, right? Absolutely. I mean, it, he, even if he's 50% effective, we're going to lose one touchdown. Be a huge decoy. The guy's a monster. Huge decoy. <laughs> Either way, yeah. Cover. yeah. And they also have, even if he's not effective, use him as decoy, and then who they have. Who's the other guy? That's just Oh, you know, no, tight, tight end. Tight end, yeah. Aaron Hernandez. The guy who could be a rec- probably a starting receiver anywhere. In they throw him a tailback. It's not even fair. It's ridiculous. They have dude. so many yeah. weapons. I mean, even if it's a decoy, Wes Welker, Ocho Cinco, which we will get into later. We'll it's just, that, man. it's going to be interesting to see whether it'll affect the outcome of the game, whether he plays or not. I think even if he's 50% effective, he's going to help. Yeah. I don't think he's going to be not effective. Definitely not. Yeah, exactly. No, he's going to use them. Exactly. And you think, does he score? At least one touchdown. You think so? I think he's going to score. Just because it's always been like, yeah. The Gronk's fun. Oh, dude. We'll get into that. All right. Next question. Question number five. Which team has the coaching advantage? Your boy Bill Belichick, my boy Tom Coughlin. <laughs> you need to tell, tell me. Hey, they're definitely not a boy. That's for sure. Right. Um, Bill Belichick, it's a, it's a no-brainer, right? We both say Bill Belichick. The reason we brought this question up, Tom Coughlin doesn't end up quitting. It's not to say Tom Coughlin's a bad coach. He's in a great elite. Like, he's top five. Bill coach. Belichick is three rings, a four, been to a fourth Super Bowl. Now he's been to five Super Coughlin's Bowls. Coughlin's eaten him once. We beat Coughlin over head. head to head. Then we'll, yeah. Oh, but can we can we stop this firing mid-season talk? Why is it every single yeah. year people put the Giants out of place? They, they, they throw them out of the conversation. Throw them out. They, they fire they Tom on, Coughlin, on. Coughlin every him single year. Put them on those two guys. It doesn't make any sense. And then look at them now. Look at me now. Laugh at all. We're just getting paper. Laugh it all the way in the Super Bowl. And as they win again. Win or lose. <laughs> yeah, we don't know. Win or lose. It doesn't matter. Just can't the fact that they're out there. Talk about the Packers didn't get that. I don't ever want to hear saying you guys not. We're the Eagles. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You know what I'm saying? The Giants. Sensitive subject, every bro. single That's year, though, bro. I know. What? Did, I mean, come on. It's a no brainer. All right. All right. Next question. <laughs> question number six. Eric, are the Pats being disrespected by all the analysts on TV? They seem to all kind of be picking the Giants. They're definitely not disrespected by Vegas because Vegas <laughs> are, makes them the favorite. But by every analyst, every guy, even the athletes that's come on, they're all taking Giants, dude. Every one of them, just like every matchup, favors the Giants, blah, blah. Right. Dude, this is Brady's re. This is Brady. They get rematch, right? I know. The, this is Brady and Belichick, and, and everyone's taking Giants. It's crazy to me because they are the favorite, and still everyone's taking Giants. Yeah, and, why, and it's like, why aren't they the favorite? It's because, it goes, I don't know, it's because they Because they said it. Belichick has two weeks to prepare for a team, and that makes them the favorite. Something like that. Some of those said. That didn't make them, I mean, what happened last what time? What happened last time? Exactly. So yeah, why are they the favorite? They have film. I mean, again, they have film. The funny thing to me that people are, I saw the stat. Any rematch in the Super Bowl, if it was the fourth time, the team that won in the regular season eventually lost the Super Bowl. Of all the Super Bowl rematches. Is that because you know why? It's hard to beat a team twice in the same season. Right. It's hard, difficult. Let alone many times. why they favored them. So now, it's like... But now, million. but still people are taking the Giants. Do you know what I mean? I right, know. yeah. I mean, well, it's only happened three times, and I know it's only, but it's still 3-0. Like, it's happened three times. Yeah. Like the opposite team wins. But it's because the Giants are dangerous. All right, next Dude, question. Dangerous. Dangerous. Wrong alert. Wrong alert. Wrong alert. <laughs> question number seven. Eric, who's got the better touchdown celebration? Your boy Gronkowski or Victor Cruz? Um, It's tough. Dude, that dance is money. What Dude, dance? Come on, show me the dance, dude. Show me the salsa dance, dude. I mean, he does it a little bit better than you. I'll give it to him. I'll give it to him. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Are you saying he does it better than me? He does a little bit I better. I taught him to dance. That's true. That's true. Now, you're, now you're disrespecting me. I'm just that alone, what you did right there, I'm going to go with Spike. I'm going with the Spike. God, Spike. Who are you going with? Since you're trying to dance, I know he's going with Since he doesn't do it as good as I do, and he doesn't wear the hat. Uh, I got to go with Gronk Spike. Gronk Spike, because it's like, it's to the point. It's like, I'm a boss. I just scored. It's time for the spike. Guy's a monster. But the, 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 the salsa the, dance is Victor flashy, Cruz man. is sick, though. It's flashy, man. It's and you know, they play the music. Flashy. If you're watching it on NBC, they're, they're likely to play the, They have the music ready. Oh, on TV. Man, it's they flashy, have the salsa music. Dude. It's dope. I like it. So, I mean, well, final, final answer. Dance. Final answer. You know what? Rock, paper, scissors. You're Victor. You're Rob Gronkowski. Okay. Victor Cruz. Rob Gronkowski, baby. Next question. Spike. Question number Ocho. 
Uh, Eric, I know this is a very sensitive subject for you. It's tough beer, dude. It's tough beer. Let's play a little over under. Ocho Cinco, your boy, catches over under three. Bro, if Gronk is limited, you think that you know he needs a deep threat, right? Mm hmm. Give the guy a chance. Give the guy, put him on the field, man. He can catch a ball. And first of all, you know what else is sensitive? My boy Ocho's in the Super Bowl. He doesn't even get his own podium for media day. That's brutal. I, I mean, he has three million Twitter followers, so he's like, he said, I'm fine. But the guy's money for media. <laughs> I know. You know, he's in the freaking Super Bowl. That's how bad of a year he's had. Man. I know. That's tough, man. Um, he can make up for it. If he has a good game, he can make up for it. Over right? under three catches. I'm going over, dude. I'm going even. It's tough. Believe it or even, not. Even. I like three catches. I might be biased, but I'm going to go over, dude. I, 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 I want him to, to do well. Why not? Because if you're Giants, what do you go, what's your game plan? He's at a hold. Trying to stop who? One of the tight ends. Rob Gronkowski's. I mean, it was Rob Yeah, it was Rob Yeah, it was two of them. Who's that big? Uh, not even Hernandez. They're trying to stop Wes Walker and, and Rob Gronkowski. So Hernandez and another receiver are going to step up. So yeah. Deion Branch. And Deion Branch is going to be covered, too. But, I mean, if you're double covering any of these other guys, like Wes. You know they don't think they're going to throw to Ocho. They're never much hits. Give them a complete shot. Why not? I say. you got to go to Ocho. I would go to Ocho. Both, both. Does that make you happy? You said the club. Yeah, I'm I said even. I like the catch for him. Thank you. Thank you, man. Question nine. Did you know nine is prime? <laughs> I'm just going to go. If not Tom Brady or Eli Manning, who could win Super Bowl MVP? Oh, man. If not Eli Manning or Tom Brady, who could win Super Bowl MVP? I'm going to go with... Give Victor me a giant Cruz. and a pat. Okay, there's a giant. Fine. For the Giants, it's Victor Cruz. So we'll see a salsa and dance, guaranteed. This, this Absolutely. Okay. I mean, if anyone, I mean, he, he's so hard to cover. He's so fast. He's so energetic. The dude's ridiculous. The guy's a monster. Who, what scout messed up on him? <laughs> Honestly, though. I don't, hey, what scout messed up on Tom Brady? So, exactly. Um, the same scout that messed up on Ryan. But the same exact guy. It's the same exact guy messed up on all three. <laughs> <laughs> so. Uh, if, for Patriots, it's got to be Gronkowski. I know I'm being boring. Those are the two guys. It's boring, bro. But uh, I mean, they're, they're both the X factors. You no, know, it's good. If those are the best players coming in. No, you. I'm going Aaron Hernandez. Okay. Yeah. Gronk. That guy, yeah. that ankle, high ankle sprain. They got to use Aaron Hernandez. And the guy can play any position. And for the Giants, for uh, Hakeem Nicks, dude. Absolutely. That's the man. And how are you going to cover Victor Cruz and Hakeem Nicks? Exactly. Exactly. One of them's going to have a great game. And right? we know the second one. Julian Edelman is at DB, bro. <laughs> Done deal. Is he the X Factor? <laughs> yeah. No. Maybe. Uh, anyone on the defensive line, maybe? Vince Wilford? For the, no, oh. for the Giants? JPP, COC, dude. COC <laughs> causing games, baby. Like, last well, question. Not. Last question. The biggest question of them all. Oh. Eric, the hardest question of them all. You tell me to pick this game, bro. I'm going to ask you to pick this game. Number 10, who's going to win the Super Bowl? The New England Patriots. Or the New York Football Giants, bro. bro. This is how I take. I want the Pats. Do I think the Giants are the better team, and all the matches favor them? Yes. But I'm just going with my gut and going with Tom Brady on this one that he's not going to lose to Eli Manning again. It's, I'm rooting for the Giants. And they're playing for Kraft. Kraft, uh, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. yeah Those are the fast. two things. It's I tough, know. but all the uh, matchups favor Giants. Who do you got, dude? I'm rooting for the Giants 1,000%. Could be I am too. I am too. I do not <laughs> see Tom Brady and Bill Belichick losing for the second time <laughs> to the Giants. I don't. And I don't see Eli Manning getting another ring. Um, maybe ever. But yeah. it is not, it's not a slide on Eli Manning. No, no, yeah. Just because. Just can you spell Can you spell Eli <laughs> without Can you spell Eli without Eli Manning? Do you believe in Eli? They can believe in Fly. You can believe in Eli. <laughs> but what's oh, the final score? Tell me the final score. Dude. Uh, thirty-one twenty-four. No, twenty-four twenty. Pats. I like that. I'll go thirty-one twenty-seven. Pats. Money. And finally, our Killamies. We can't get rid of those. Come on. All right, Killamies. Um. These Super Bowl prop bets are kind of killing me, dude. I mean, if I was in Vegas, don't get me wrong, I was I'll bet them. Ready? The first one. Uh, coin toss? Heads or, heads or tails. You know what I'm going to go with? Tails never fails, bro. What are you going with? <laughs> tails never fails, dude. I got to go opposite of you. If you like Kobe, I like LeBron. You got to go opposite. Same so, thing, heads. Man. But now, I really don't care. What yes. color is the Gatorade going to be as my dump it on the coach? What color? <laughs> blue. Call it right now blue. 1,000% sure. Do they even have different colors on the field? Do they go, um, Mr. Brady, would you like a blue Gatorade right now? Would you like a red Gatorade right now? How about a yellow one? I'm an orange. What? I'm an orange kind of Gatorade. I'm going to go orange. Orange or wrong. Orange or wrong. I'm going to go orange. All right. And, uh. Who scores first? Oh, alert. <laughs> no, I was going to go. T. 
Team or player? Player, bro. Give me a player. Victor Cruz, without a doubt. Oh, you, know, you know what? He's a kicker. You know who's going to score first? The Bob Bradshaw. Or the law firm. Ben Jarvis Green Ellis. <laughs> and, oh, this is, this is a money question and this for is you. the greatest. Your boy, OBJ. The guy's killing it right now. Number six. And Eli. Who's going to have more completions? Eli? No. The Heat play and Sunday. Who's going to have What's the problem, man? You tell uh, me. Oh, Eli Manning. More completions. More completions. Right. And LeBron has points in the game. Depends who they play. LeBron can easily really get up to 27. The question is, does LeBron want to be a story on um, Super Bowl night, too? Because that could you know I mean? hit. Because he could drop 30 and be like, oh, uh, this is one. But look at LeBron. He had a huge fight. You fight. never know. Eli could be, I mean, the last game was thrown, what, like 55 times? 50 times, times, bro. So uh, he could easily get 35 he could get 30. He could, he could drop 30. That's a, that's a close one. That's, a, that's, that's, why, that's, it's a great that's one. why it's a pop. Anyway. You're going to get an answer, though. Who you? Well, of course, you got to go with your boy. Yeah. Since you're going, I'm going with Eli. I believe in Eli. Can I go with LeBron, bro? I believe in Eli. You know, they're going to be updating him. No, that's not. It's before the game. He's though. like, he's like, oh, I need some attention. He's just going to go 40. Because you know what Eli's getting at 40. He knows that. Yeah, he, the way he's going for 40. <laughs> oh, don't. <clears throat> and you know what you know who needs 40 right now? Chris Bosh. That's a different story. We'll be back. I know we're, we're going to be doing there, but I know. We'll, we'll, we'll be back. We're we'll back. We're back. We need more back. Dude, this guy. See this guy? This guy's facial hair, bro. I love this guy. I do. I'm James Harden. Come find us at the club. <laughs> All right. I'm Doug Gonzalez. e Blacks, We're out. Brock. Talk to you on 10. New thing. Have fun. Oh, shout outs? Shout outs, Dominic Garcia. Joel Garcia. That's Good. really all we need to you say. You got $7. You know, Shane you know, oh, oh, Jacobson has been killing it. Who else? Tyler throws in some comments. Tyler Rubin. What's up? Tyler, Tyler Thomas Thomas too. Oh, Tyler Thomas too. too. Who else throws in comments? That like girl, some girls throw in some comments that we know. Oh, you Aggie. Know. Agatha. Okay. Good friend. I love you, Aggie. Right, we like it. Bye. Bye.